Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's Anita here and I'm bringing you guys another week in life. So please stick around. If you know or have noticed that I have been absent for a while, my father passed away in the beginning of this year. So my family and I really just try to deal with this emotional part of our lives and just taking the time off in order to heal and I feel like now I've gotten back into my routine and I'm in a better place to start filming my day for you guys. Um, remember to like this video and also go and follow me on my social media platforms if you would like to see more of what I get up to in a day. Enjoy guys! I am currently experiencing the worst flu symptoms so I took the day off and I just quickly went into clicks and bought myself a nasal spray and I do have my prescription meds and some other things um, so I want to try and relieve the symptoms as quick as possible so it doesn't worsen with time and then I am looking forward to make myself the biggest cup of tea possible I feel like when I move around I'm gonna faint so I am definitely heading in the route of a flu or cold so I just want to you know take it easy but I will still vlog for you guys and you know try and keep it interesting so what you're saying is it's not enough just write it off like a oh my goodness, this looks so good. I am eating some diet food uh, as prescribed by my personal trainer. So I do have 30 grams of uh, uncooked pasta measured and then cooked. And then I have like 50 grams of brown mushrooms. And I also have 80 grams of skinless chicken breast that I fried this morning. You guys saw that. And I also drizzled like the tiniest amount, I think it's like a teaspoon of light reduced mayonnaise because it needs to be some kind of fat component. Um, I was thinking avocado because it could also work nicely here, but our avos aren't ripe yet, so I'm still waiting for that. And this is my like lunch and then later this afternoon i'm gonna have another meal um because i have to have like five meals a day I quickly popped into Woolies to buy myself some ingredients for uh, fresh pressed juice. Um, I love making them especially before winter um, just to build up the immune system and really detox the body. So for the fresh pressed juices I love making it with celery fingers. So I already have the pre-cut ones. You can buy the longer tall stem celeries and just cut off the top Part. so i have that and then i also bought some whole ginger and then i just cut it into smaller cubes so it fits into the uh, juice maker and then i also like putting in oranges and it's now orange season so i thought it would be perfect for the juices and just for snacking and a good source of vitamin c i do have raspberries they are 
absolutely delicious and I just love how they add an extra sweet element to things like yogurts and then because I've been ill this past week um, I drank all my tea so I had to stock up on some more and I absolutely love the hibiscus tea it's a real classic I just like drinking tea in the evenings um, so that's what I bought from Woolies So I went into Vivior Beauty Studio to do my nails today and I absolutely love this color. Neutrals match any outfit you have and I just love the short style. My mom surprised me this morning with this beautiful gift. I will open all my gifts at once. I'm so excited to see what it is. And then this beautiful bouquet. I am having the best birthday so far. And we just finished up making some dinner for tonight. And the prep is done. Now it's just to enjoy the day and just soak up all the beautiful energy. And thank you to everyone's lovely messages. From my second mother, Naughty, the Christian Dior perfume. Here she is, Holy Peony by Christian Dior. I wish you guys could smell this scent. It smells like heaven. And then with each perfume, you get a sample. And the sample I received was the Joy by Dior. And it's the perfect purse size. From my beloved boyfriend, Alien. From Mother. Yami Tsuki decided to partner up with me again and I absolutely love working with them because they have the best sushi in Joburg and I honestly think they are some of the top competitors. I love their flavor combos and their quality never disappoints. I created this super funky reel for them on Instagram. I will make sure to link it down below. If you are in the area of Bedford View, I highly recommend you book a table and try it out for yourself. My time, my mind, my time.
Good morning everyone, hope you guys are doing well. So I just finished up my lead generation cold calling for the day. As you know, I'm a real estate agent, so that's part of my everyday job. And I just did my makeup because I'm almost on my way to go and donate to Frida Hartley Shelter for women and children. As you know, I have a non-profit organization called Giving Grace and i am so fortunate enough to be able to donate and i want to encourage each and every one of you to create the habit of donating giving back to the community and changing lives you don't realize what impact you can make until you make it and I'm a huge advocate for women's health, so that's why I decided to go with um, Frida Hartley Women Shelter. Um, I specifically want to focus on educating women on health matters. Period poverty is such a big problem in South Africa, and I think people forget um, how harsh it could be. I mean, if you are in school and you can't even attend your classes because of a period, that shouldn't be the root cause of not being educated. So I will show you guys exactly what are in those packs and then we're gonna head out all the way to Joburg and donate. I cannot wait, I'm so happy. As you can see, I'm basically done with packing the women's parcels and I will show you exactly what's inside and shout out to Pack and Spice for the beautiful brown packaging and for their amazingly affordable prices. Hi everyone, welcome back. So I'm going to show you what is in one of these brown bags. As you've heard in the previous clip, I'm a huge advocate for women's health and most of the contents within these gift bags are necessary for women hygiene and they will definitely help with period poverty in South Africa. So I have one brown bag and in the brown bag, I have a small brown bag um, with some robusty in and then I have these very cute Petals Classic pads with a pack of eight so definitely for one period and then I also have a razor um, I think this could benefit a lot of women and then I have some candy just to say thank you. Thank you for being yourself and being you. And then I have this super cute note that I will read to you in just a second of my thoughts and feelings towards each and every woman in South Africa. And that is what I packed in one of the parcels. I just want to tell you, even though I don't know you, that I love you. Life can be tough sometimes and it seems unfair how some people have so much and others little. Life is tough, but you know what? So are you. My dearest friend, I hope this alone will help you hold your head high, put a smile on your face and choose warmth in your heart. Just know that you are special and loved by me and so many others just because you are you. The Lord says, I heard your prayer, trust my timing. I wish you all the best in the world. May life be abundantly, f may your life be abundantly filled with blessings from me. Thank you. 